on people Matthew living differently here I just wanted to go ahead and tell you this is my second episode of wheelchair rugby so stick around it's gonna be very exciting and you won't regret it all right people I just showed up to practice we're gonna get inside the chair and there's a couple of new people that you know are really outgoing so I'm gonna go ahead and talk to them pick around it's gonna be a good one Well, here we are with Cameron and Lisa. These are volunteers and they decided to go ahead and come out and, you know, come and volunteer with me and enjoy and play the game. So tell me about yourself. Why did you guys get involved in uh, the whole thing? Um, we're part of an organization called YMSL and it's Young Men's Diversity. It's basically aimed at um, helping you grow the bond between you and your mom. And so you just, we just go out and do a lot of service projects together and stuff like this. And so we've actually helped Rise a lot and we've done their water sports stuff. Oh, like great bond. Yeah. But he's so, never done Oh, that's your Yeah, it's the first time. And we loved it three years ago when I did it with my other So I knew he would love it too. So it should be good. If I did it, it should be good. Oh, I'm telling you, man. It's going to be a blast. Racing down this court, turning on a dime. Picking things up, banging into these on the chairs. Well, he's working on his skills right now. Yeah, to get I'm still a rookie. Used to turning around and on a dime and all that. Oh, okay. 
So for you guys, all you have to do in order for you to really turn on the dime is just pinch and grab and then just allow this to actually turn. Also, you can actually have a sharp motion just by not turning this way because it's a turn radius, but you actually just turn like this, turn like that, and you actually turn the entire round. So, well, Cameron, you and I are gonna actually have some fun doing a little a race right here down on the court. I swear, y'all need to take drills. it easy on him, and you said absolutely not, right? Absolutely not. So. This is not. This is not a uh, you know a, a go easy on me sport. There's this is no a very, helmets or anything yeah, like that. Hey, when these people who got to get into this kind of sport, they don't wear helmets. That's they don't wear what pads. a mom would True. say, right? A mom. True. <laughs> a mom term. I'm telling you. <laughs> well. With all that said, we're just gonna go ahead and shut our mouths. We're gonna enjoy our drills, and we're just gonna go from there. All right? Is it like right here? This, this little ridge. Okay. So you use the gloves for traction. Yeah. For your safety, as well as good traction. This is a quadriplegic sport, which is totally unfair because this is so damn fun. <laughs> What's that? Hi. You're doing great. How are you? Hey. What are you doing? I am about to play rugby. That's a game. It's a ball game. Is it basketball? It's much more fun than basketball. Oh yeah. Can you show me? Huh? Can you show me? Yeah. All right, get like out there. Man, Shane, you got a sweat going. You don't play. time you know I've never been an athletic person before this I always sucked at sports and coming from a divorce and not really having much in my life right now coming out here really does make me feel much better knowing about my life is the way it is and you know coming from porn fiction and all that stuff I just can't see myself actually being hooked on that stuff, lying to people. I really like enjoy coming out here and just 
feeling the endorphins, feeling the adrenaline, getting the sweat on, and I know that it's God. And I know that as soon as I get off of you know rugby practice and game, and I'm back in my place, I'm always gonna remember I don't need that kind of stuff. And I just need to go ahead and hang around like-minded people and then just have fun. It's a blast. <laughs> Like volunteer. It's an awesome sport, isn't it? Yes, it is. In my well, it concludes the end of our journey of rugby. Once again, I had a blast, and as you can see, you know, it just brightens up people's lives, including mine. I mean, I gotta tell you, man, as bleak and um, ugly a life can be, as alone as I am inside of that room. It's a real good blessing to actually have something to call freedom, something to actually make me feel good about myself, something to actually make me feel good to share with others like you. Because at the end of the day, when it's all said and done, you know, we all have to go to sleep. We all have to go to sleep. We always have to remember what we did in our lives. And I just want to have fun, you know. Can you really blame a guy for trying? <laughs> Well, anyway, if you guys already haven't liked and subscribed to my channel, please do so. Everything counts. Please share with your friends, and we'll go ahead and have a blast together. Wheelchair Sports is now my jam, all right? All right, man. See you later.